Hello, you've reached Ashcraft Company's video channel, and today we're going to take a quick spin around Simline Corporation's website to select chilled water buffer tank. Two ways to get into the selection process. One is down here, start sizing. If you click that, it'll take you to a selection grid. You can select the product and then begin sizing. We're also going to show you the product's dropdown. And you can see in the product dropdown, you can select from a multitude of Simline products. Today's selection, chilled water buffer tanks. Simline chilled water buffer tanks are designed to be used with chillers which do not have water volumes of sufficient size in relation to the chiller. The insufficiently sized systems do not have enough buffer capacity for the chilled water causing poor temperature control, erratic system operation, and excessive compressor cycling. The CWB solves this problem by adding volume to the buffer system, uh, to buffer the system rather. The CWB reduces the rate of change of the return water. So to begin sizing, we click the sizing button. We're going to leave the desired ASME working pressure at the default of 125, adjust it as necessary. Um, if you do know the required volume of the chilled water buffer tank, you can click yes here at step two, and it will give you a nice chart from which you can select and move on down to nozzle size and the rest of the points that you need to complete your submittal and specification generation. We're going to say that we do not know, and this will lead us into a um, tool that helps us calculate the size of the chilled water buffer tank we need. We're going to start off with a smaller chiller size of 200 tons and we're going to enter the system volume gallons per ton. Uh, gives us a clue right here that the range is going to be 3 to 10. We're going to select 5. Uh, we're also going to uh, calculate the existing water volume of the system uh, by selecting the size of the pipe that will be used throughout the system. Uh, the length of the pipe we're going to estimate at 400 feet and the terminal equipment volume in gallons we're going to take a swag and call it 100 and down here in step 3 you can also see you could select other types and sizes of pipe as needed we're going to stick with the 6 inch flange. Step 4 asks you about desired support we're going to leave the default selection of leg stands noting that you could also select seismic zone for angle legs and uh, step 5 factory insulation down here gives us a rough chart telling you what the uh, insulation thickness would be. A typical insulation would be 90 degrees Fahrenheit to maximum ambient temperature and 35 degrees high tank temperature resulting in a one and a half inch uh, insulation thickness uh, which can be done at the factory for you for your application if you'd like. Uh, what we typically do is allow the tank to be insulated in the field uh, along with the rest of the equipment. Uh, step five asks uh, excuse me, we've already covered factory insulation step five. Now, uh, we click the continue button. Clicking continue, we have an opportunity to review all the selections we've made. Make sure our I's are dotted, our T's are crossed. Uh, looks like we're going to have a 300 gallon uh, tank. And now we'll click continue. Here you can see that the chilled water buffer tank, the V300 CWB, uh, is illustrated for you with drawing dimensions. There's also a specification here in the text box box rather. Uh, at this point you could click save spec and it would uh, bring up a uh, save the text file dialog. You could also select save CAD. Uh, we'll click that one for uh, this example and choose PDF as the format type. And you can see, so I'll, I'll bring this down here in the window for you, we can see the same submittal type drawing that we saw earlier in PDF format, of course also available in DWG format. Uh, because I'm a rep, uh, I think this request quote, excuse me, request quote button exists for me, and it may not for you in the engineer version. But you can see that that's an option, and we can get you a quote uh, quickly so you can move on with the rest of your day. Thanks for tuning in. Please find us on the web at AshcraftCompany.com. That's Ashcraft. The word company is all spelled out. .com, and of course, we'll have more videos like this in the future.